Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum. So here I have a great news if you're coming from React or if you're going to React from Flutter, it doesn't matter which one. The good news is, did you know that you can write React hooks in Flutter just like this? So if you're coming from React, it may look like this. A lot of you already know that in React or React Native, they use use state, you know, use state. And then they also use use effect a lot. They do use it for updating states as well as for calling API. So if you are using Flutter or React, so that should be a good sweet spot for you, switching between or learning both at the same time. We know that in React you use use state to update part of the screen. That means that if one of the variables they change, the UI changes or revealed automatically that exactly the same happens in Flutter. In React, they use use effect to call something only once, or you can also call it multiple times. In our case, we are using use effect to call fetch data. And as you see that fetch data here calls API call and stores value and update the UI. So if you want to learn both and if you want to update state, and then you also want to call API. So to find the similarities both of them, you could use a Flutter plugin. The plugin itself is called Flutter Hooks. Flutter Hooks. So once you learn how to use this thing, you can learn React or React Native as well. Or if you're coming from React or React Native, using this and updating state in Flutter would be a piece of cake for you. Don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button. Thank you.